Looking for me to let's go Take me on this journey home I don't wanna wait no Hey, hey, y'all, it's your good sis Erica Bain back again with another amazing All-American video. Y'all, the season has ended, but that don't mean that the content gonna stop. So in this video, as you can tell by the title, we are gonna talk about why Billy's response or reaction to Spencer was a serious problem. Let's get into it. Okay, so can we go ahead and establish and really acknowledge the fact that Spencer is very important to Billy's life? While we all make jokes about, you know, Spencer being the son that Billy never had and Spencer <laughs> being Billy's favorite son and all of the things that, you know, we have definitely put up or that I have seen and laughed at or even joked about myself on these videos. Even though, like, okay, Spencer is not Billy's son, we can acknowledge that he definitely operates in that space and he's very important spencer is very important to billy billy is very important to spencer that is a given right y'all spencer operates for billy as a athlete that he coaches as a son because you know just of their familiar relationship and their history and his history with his actual family as well as a best friend and i have said this i have said this so many times on numerous occasions in numerous videos so it's no surprise that i feel like that now is it appropriate that billy kind of looks at spencer like a best friend in times no however these two black men one young one a little older definitely show up and support each other love on each other and have cultivated a friendship in one another and that is what it is and honestly for me the amount of history that they have the feelings the emotional ties the understanding of the emotional ties are all a part of the reason why Billy responded in the way that he did and the words that he chose to use in communicating his disappointment to Spencer after Spencer revealed that he had been training with Jordan before Jordan was cleared that is why it was a problem shout out to Naya because Naya made this point while we were talking the other day and she was just like Erica it's emotional warfare like he really just enacted emotional warfare on Spencer and you could see Spencer shrink in that moment. And there's very few times that you see Spencer shrink in that way. I don't want to mention the other times where I feel like he shrunk because in the comment section, there'll be a whole conversation about something else. And I really want to focus on Billy and Spencer in this video. But there's very few times that we have seen Spencer shrink in the way that he shrunk. And you could tell that that bomb landed. Like it was emotional warfare. Billy fired an emotional missile and it hit. It landed and it hit Spencer. And ultimately, I feel like it changed them. It changed their dynamic, especially because Billy went on to confirm his disdain for this one action, this one misstep, this one thing that honestly is not even Spencer's fault. Jordan should be getting all of this smoke because Jordan was going to do it whether Spencer did it with him or not. Now, could Spencer have come to him and said something in the beginning? Yes. But even if Billy would have known, Jordan would have found a way to do it. These kids have found a way to get married, to relapse, to do all types of stuff. They are crashing cars. They are doing, doing all this stuff regardless. So for me, I feel like Spencer made a decision. Was it the best decision? No. Was it a wrong decision? I ain't gonna say that either. In the same breath that you turn around and say that you wish that Spencer was at Beverly Hills so that he could help protect Jordan. In that same breath, when Spencer gives you a way that he has protected your son while not being at Beverly Hills, you turn around and communicate this a really disrespectful, distasteful, disloyal, emotional bomb to him in reference to you being just deeply disappointed. Spencer ain't kick your dog. Spencer ain't, you know, shoot up your house. Like to me, the level of response that Billy gave was completely unwarranted and out of nowhere. I just, I want it to make sense, Billy Bean. Can you make it make sense for me? Now, again, I'm not taken away from the fact that Jordan should not have been working out prior to him being cleared. That is a fact. Honestly, Spencer was doing the same thing. You ain't even had this much smoke when Spencer was doing it to himself. And this to me was a two-parter and something that I feel like could really deeply emotionally affect Spencer and take him to a place where we don't actually want him to be at. So one, this reaction from Billy and how Billy is moving with him in this episode. And then two, how Jordan starts to move with him in this episode. These are two very, very important men in his life. And to watch them turn their back on him in the way that they did, even though Spencer has done nothing but be loyal, be supportive, 
be loving of these two men in particular it just boggles my mind it's like at this point spencer i want you to start shooting first like i want you to do whatever you got to do for you i need spencer to start being way more selfish i need spencer to stop caring as much because when it comes time for people to care about his feelings when it comes time for people to show up for him and give him a little bit more empathy and understanding when it comes time for people to really shoulder the burden and i know we go back and forth about spencer needs to take the world off his back this is why he really can't y'all this is why he defaults to going to himself and relying on himself because in moments like this where he is actually honest and vulnerable with you about something you decide to turn it into this billy how does he go to you moving forward how does he trust that you will receive him and not take your love away because this this is given very much so conditional love spencer probably looks at billy like oh he loves me unconditionally and on this moment and this time you just put a condition on it i love you up until the point that you work out with with jordan when he's not supposed to be working out i love you to the point until you completely just get my disapproval by some random action that i didn't even think that she was going to respond that way to yes could it have compromised jordan's health yes but again this was a decision that jordan made not spencer so again all of this smoke all of this disapproval all of this disappointment it really needs to be hitting jordan baker in the chest and y'all honestly i think that this is going to also be a setup for season four i've made no qualms about the fact that i think that season four is going to be heavily focused on jordan we're about to get his time it's time that jordan grows up it's time that jordan changes and now we're going to get a ton of of experiences and pushes to take Jordan through some things so that he can learn and grow and adjust in season four and part of it might actually be the people around him holding him accountable for his BS there's no way in what world Jordan do you actually swing on Spencer a second time after he already forgave you for the first time and y'all got back to y'all so-called brotherhood that he actually was the best man to your wedding that he actually has been there for you emotionally physically mentally this entire time Spencer is literally one of the people who does an amazing job of just having so much grace and empathy for Jordan and only seeing the best for him, even when Jordan is in the process of double crossing or disrespecting Spencer. And enough is enough. So yeah, y'all, that is my quick little breakdown on why Billy's response to Spencer was completely, utterly, ridiculously a problem. It's going to be a problem that they need to address. And I'm pretty sure they're going to address. I don't think they would have had Billy make such a visceral reaction without planning to actually go into depth about it later on. And I'm going to be looking forward to that. Maybe season four, we're going to get a little bit more understanding around Billy as well, because a lot of what Jordan's issues are, are steeped in the lack of presence of his dad lack of approval that he feel like from his dad so maybe we're also going to get a ton of of billy understanding and situations in season four as well let me know what you thought of the season finale in the comment section down below what did you think about billy's response to spencer in this way in this moment I would really love to hear if you have any questions, what your thoughts were, what your initial reactions were. Drop all of those things in the comment section down below. Even though the season is over, we are still coming to you with a ton of amazing content, y'all. I'm dropping down and talking about a lot of things because that finale was wild. If you haven't already, go ahead and check out my episode 19 breakdown video because I have a standard video for that, as well as I did a live. I did a live where I was actually breaking it down as well, giving y'all my initial reactions. I'm still working on getting my 24 hour live pulled back up. Unfortunately, it was taken down at 19 hours. However, I want to appeal from YouTube about that and I'm just waiting for them to finish uploading the video. But because it's 19 hours of content, y'all, it's taking a little bit longer. So once I have that, you'll be able to check it out. I have some amazing interviews on there. Like I talk with the wonderful, amazing Karima Westbrook, who plays Grace James. I talk with the insiders I love so very much. Shout out to Naya, shout out to Antonio, shout out to Naomi. I did my initial reactions while watching the episode. It's so many amazing things in that 24 hours live. So be sure to hit that subscribe button so that once that's ready and available, you won't miss the actual re-upload and making that available. And if you miss any of my all-american content you can go ahead and check it out right now in this all about all-american playlist if you're looking for something new to watch now that the season has ended i got two amazing suggestions for you right here because these shows is lit okay lit it's your girl erica vane i will see you in the next one bye Makes me this way. Why